to meet you. The Redeemer of Psalms 109, let me read it. Psalms 109, 107 says this. Oh, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. His step. Hear me. Someone said, won't he do it? It is 107. What was on my life? I heard God. I heard God. And closed my ear to your rumor. I heard God and closed my ear to your rumor. I heard God and I closed my ear to your gossip. I heard God. And so because I heard God, I move with the voice of God. And because I did that, you are looking at a woman. You are looking at a man that the Holy Spirit took the hand of God and blessed him simply because you thought I was going to lose it. But the Holy Spirit resuscitated not just my child that you walked out on. He resuscitated everything. Everything that was attached to me because I was obedient. And he is about to change your story. Watch this. The Bible declares that you don't understand that the Redeemer is about to meet you. The Redeemer of Psalms 109. Let me read it. Psalms 109, 107 says this. Oh, give thanks to the Lord. For he is good. His steadfast love endures forever. Let the redeem of the Lord say so. For he redeems you in the time of trouble. The Bible declares in 2 Kings 8. That this woman was in trouble. And she represented the redeemer. And she redeemed her stuff. Because the redeemer said so. I need right now offering time. 107 for the redempting power of God to redeem everything that you lost, whether it was in court, whether it was a job, whether it was the pandemic or whatever you lost, the Redeemer is now redeeming stuff in your time of trouble. It is 107 www.carchronicles.org dollar sign 7777. It is CCM 777747 107 on Psalms 107. That is the redeeming redeeming power of God. Hold on people don't get nervous but I need those who need the redeemer. That is your offering. On Psalms 107 it is 107 www.carchronicles.org ccm 77747 listen to me. It is the redeemer. It is the redeemer. I need the redeemer now. Go on the court. Go go ahead because what she did she got a repeat, an appeal because of the redeemer. Hear me. Someone said, won't he do it? It is 107 on Psalms 107. To everyone else, hear me by way of Jeremiah 51. Jeremiah 51. Hear me by way of Jeremiah 51. You're about to be vindicated. Yeah. The, the Lord has brought about your vindication. Come, let us declare in Zion the works of our God. Let him vindicate you. Because they telling one side of the story. You know that ain't the truth. Your offering is 27, 7, or 57. 27, 7, or 57. And that is on Jeremiah 51. You're about to be vindicated. She was vindicated. You could pay pal dot me slash Jamela Gooden. She was vindicated. She was vindicated. Watch this. She was vindicated right in front of something that was supposed to die. Listen. Lee Horn, I got you. Lee Horn, I got you. She was vindicated. He said, I don't need to hear nothing else. Vindicator. 7, 27 to 57 or Jeremiah 51. I, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't need, I don't need, I don't need to hear nothing else. Vindicator, now. Let the redeem of the Lord say so. Let the redeem of the Lord say so. And she was the redeemer of the Lord and she said so. Let me tell you about what the Holy Spirit did. Let me tell you what God did. Um, the prophet told me, and here he is right here. He said, oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I, I, I got to tell you what God did. And he said, really? Okay. 
Stop. I don't need to hear no more. Vindicate her. Give her back her house. Give her back her finances. Everything that she was not supposed to get back in this famine. Give it to her. Give it to her. That was custom. That you 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 jump ship. No, no, we ain't a family together. And you leave. And now you're going to leave and now you want your stuff back? No, you were not there to, to, you weren't there to pay taxes. You weren't there to till the land. You weren't there to do nothing. So therefore, it belongs to the government. That was, that's the way it was supposed to go down. But he said, no, 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 no. What happened? All right. Give it back to her. Why? Because I told you what the Lord did. And when you open up your mouth, favor falls. Favor falls. When I tell you what the Lord did, I am overcoming by the blood of the Lamb and the words of my testimony. My testimony is about to redeem everything that I lost because he's going to give me something to tell. I am Pastor Jamela Gooden. And every time you open up your mouth and you say, I need the Holy Spirit to speak to me, come to this page. It's on Instagram. It's on Facebook. It's on YouTube. And you can get a word from the Lord at the Car Chronicles movement. If you have not watched the Car Chronicles in a while, you need to come on back. Those of you who are watching the replay, God bless you for taking the time to share this. God bless you for taking the time to watch the replay. But Jesus is on his way back. Your soul salvation is important. Father God, those that are sinners that are watching this, let them come to the place of repentance. Say, Father, I'm sorry. Forgive me for my sins. I make you my Lord and Savior. Right then and there, just invite them in your life. Get a Bible. Just open it up. You could start reading the book of Proverbs or Psalms. You could just, just begin to say, Father, Lord, help me. Holy Spirit, help me. He will speak to you. And I promise you, your life will change. You need to understand that Jesus Christ is real. He is a God of love. He is not a God of hate. He loves us. He does not like our sin. But his son's job is to redeem us. Is to redeem us from life and from the mark that we miss called sin. And to hold our place accountable saying, Lord, forgive me. I did it. I'm sorry. And Lord, I do not want to go to the lake of fire. Please find yourself to a place of repentance and say, Lord, I need you. I am Pastor Jamela Gooden, and every time you click my button, I promise you, I will always give you the truth with love, some humor, but the fear of God. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. 7.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, your time all over this beautiful world. We're praying for you. We're praying for you. We're praying for you, and we're not going to stop.